Here are the highlights from the Central York game. Check out this back check by Taya. She's right here. Watch her go. Hard angle. Boom. Forces the offside. Great job, Taya. She back checked so hard this game. Here's Ariana. Back checking. Active stick. Keeps her feet moving. A little poke check. Easy to break that up when you got a back checker like that. Our forecheck was great this game too. Watch this forecheck. We got our bull. I think that's Ariana. We got our D pinching. We got Kate, our hawk. And look at all that space she has to just attack the net. Great job. Here's another one. Most of our chances came off the forecheck. Bull. There's our fox. There's Katie, our hawk. Sorry, Kate, our hawk. Look at how much space she has. She gets a borderline breakaway, and honestly, watch, she gets hooked by this girl right here. Hooked right in the hands. See that? Watch this stick. Right there. Right up in the hands. Ref misses it. We still get the breakaway. Oof, so close. Nice try. Uh, watch Haley here. Same thing, except she's the fox. Steals the puck. Look at all that ice in the middle. See, girls, one thing I want you to realize is any time you play a team that plays with the winger far out, usually they want to make that cross-ice pass, right? So you have that player in the middle, you're going to pick off passes. The second thing is when that player is wide, it creates a lot of space in the middle. So when there's a turnover, attack that void, attack that space quickly, just like Haley does here. She just walks right in, gets a breakaway. Oh my gosh, so close. Uh, here's another one. Let's see here. Now in this play, we don't have a fox, right? Sarah's a little too far over here, right? But we do have a hawk, okay? And what I want to show you is anytime they pass to their center, if you have a hawk, now Haley's pretty high here. She could probably be down here. But nonetheless, they make that pass. Haley's one stride away from challenging this girl. She wins the battle. Almost, she loses an edge there. Almost gets in there. See how important it is to have a hawk? Uh, here's another one. There's your bull, Kate. There's your fox, Charlotte. There's your hawk. I think that's Lillian, right? And that allows your D to pinch. You keep the puck in, and once again, look at that space in the middle, right? A lot of room in the middle. This clip, I think, very clearly shows how important it is to take away the middle ice. So watch this. I'm going to stop it right there and check out this view. So right here, let me just take it back a second. Right there. That's what I want to show you. So there's the puck carrier right there. There's Nyla who's coming in and she's taking away the middle ice. What are this girl's passing options right now? She can go up the boards, which is probably the safest option, but Kate is like right there ready to break it up. She can make a pass to this girl here, but she's got to put it right through Nyla to get it there. She can go cross ice to this girl, but she's got to go right through Nyla to get it there. Her other option is she could go D to D. Maybe she could make that pass, but you know, Nyla reads that. She gets her, she's not that far from that lane, right? Nyla's doing a really good job of taking away the middle ice. This girl does not have a lot of options on this play. She decides to go with the safe up the boards options. Kate steals it, and look at this chance we get, right? Two on one. Kate makes a really smart play to protect the puck. She doesn't panic. She turns her body, protects the puck, slides it to Ariana almost get a goal and I think we get another really good chance right here Sophia Nyla in front oh what a chance guys it all came because we took away the middle ice this game honestly 80% of our chances our best chances came because of our four check so keep doing what we talked about high hawk we gotta have that hawk taking away the middle ice the fox and the bull okay really good job we had other good things in this game. We had some good skates. Watch Sarah here, use her body. I love this. Just lean, power through, use your edges, and then make a really nice little same side pass to Kate. Kate, 
you are so big and strong i'd love to see you just beeline to that net don't stick handle here just like chris french showed you push that puck and go you're bigger and stronger than that girl when you cut back in it just allows everyone to get back onto the defensive side of the puck put some pressure on them with your size you got those hands you can always go to them but just drive through right there use your body just drive through okay really nice play though overall girls here's another good play this is kate this is what i mean by just driving through she's so strong you know just push through like look at that get it in deep you got somebody going to the net if that shot is on this side of the net rebound boom maybe it's in okay really nice play watch this two on two by jazz and sophia i love how jazz plays this sophia does a great job and look jazz isn't worried she trusts her partner she's taking away that passing option and sophia is so good on one-on-one she just breaks this play up stays in front of the girl challenges her right before the house and just boop it's gone really nice play sophia watch this d zone face off we got to do this every time girls okay watch our two wingers and they are gone they're out and look that puck's not getting off we got a player right there that girl bobbles it maybe it's a breakaway for nyla nyla i think draws a penalty to me that should have been maybe a trip you know what do you think yeah i think that's a trip <laughs> So really good, girls. I like how they just get out on this play, right? Everybody's getting out. Like, our D is picking up their player. Our forwards are getting out. Center, look, we're taking away that middle ice. That's perfect. The only little thing here is our weak side D. You cannot lose the race to this player. Okay, and I'm going to show you why. If we win the face-off, you got to be first to that puck. If we lose the face-off, you have to beat this player back to your net. And watch what happens here. Jazz gets off a little. See how this girl's even cheating on the faceoff? If she cheats, you cheat. You come just as far in, okay? That ref's hand move, you got to step in front of her, okay? But we lose the race. So if we had a won that draw, that girl's getting that puck for sure. And if this girl gets the shot off, she's beating you to the net, okay? So just keep that in mind, defense. You also have to get going on that draw. If that girl cheats, you cheat too, just as much as she is, okay? The ref, you know, if they don't notice it, you just do it too. Uh, here's a great D to D pass by Jazz. She loses it at the line, but takes a good look. Sees Sari, gets it over, pucks back in. Really good job. Uh, this is a wonderful little play by Kate on the boards chips it by and there's ariana on the two on one i like how ariana drives wide here what you want to do when you get a step on a two on one is now slide it over to your your partner here okay but really good just make that pass but really really good and I, this is maybe my favorite play of the game it's super simple but it's really effective d this is what i want to see you do watch what sophia does in front simple right it's not just that she picks off the pass it's she doesn't panic like sometimes we're picking off passes and we're just slapping it away you know if she slaps it anywhere over here maybe this girl's picking it up right she slaps it in the corner you just don't know what do you want to do when you get that puck skate the puck to safe ice and that's what she does she skates it below the red and then she starts wheeling okay skate the puck to safe ice wherever it is okay and then make a play she can pass to nyla she can chip it out she can do lots of different things skate the puck to safe ice really good job girls lots of great clips lots of great learnings that four check was magic this game